It's, it's a fun exercise to think about how much time people are spending on Amazon Prime Day. So when you look at the numbers, our estimate is about $10 billion in lost productivity around companies around the nation. And the way we did it was, let's say there's 85 million Prime members. We know not all of them are going to be shopping while at work. We know that not all of them have memberships that are going to be at work. And we know that 30 hours means that most of that's not at work anyway. So let's just be conservative and let's say they spend one minute each time deals roll off. And when you put that all together with GDP data, productivity data, add up all the numbers. I don't want to do the equations in front of everybody, but you multiply it all out, you get $10 billion. And as we know, there's a lot of people, they don't even have Prime, but they're going to use the data to think about whether they want to buy Prime. So they're going to still be looking at deals that we haven't even calculated. So the range could be really anywhere higher or lower than that. And if the deals are really good, you might see people spend more than one minute per deal. And the other thing to think about is, really, it might not be so bad because a lot of people, they waste time at work anyway, thinking about what movie they saw in right. 1968. <laughs> mm -hmm. So it's possible Playing that work, solitaire. exactly, it's possible that work's not going to lose the $10 billion, but Facebook and Twitter and all the other web surfing that you do, maybe that's what's really going to suffer today and not the actual work. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.